The minority has hinted at plans to table a motion in Parliament over the recent controversy associated with a comprehensive sexuality education. Now, according to them, attempts to introduce CSE as part of the curriculum are at variance with the Ghanaian culture and customs. They further added that the education minister had not stated the full facts about the CSE and may be the subject of their motion in the House. There is more from the address where the minority called for the withdrawal of the CSE curriculum in this report. Comprehensive sexuality education has been the subject of vigorous debate in the country in recent times. Many have had cause to oppose the inclusion of the subject of CSE in the school curriculum. The latest group to state its position on the matter is the minority in parliament. Addressing the press, minority leader Haruna Idrisu expressed disappointment that government was considering CSE, which is at variance with the customs and traditions of Ghanaians. We wish to place on record that we are on all fours with the leadership of moral society, religious leaders, parents, civil society groups, and members of the Ghanaian public in general who have voiced legitimate and justified revulsion over the introduction of the comprehensive sexuality education into the curriculum of basic schools in Ghana. The minority condemns in the strongest terms possible the reckless CSE agenda of the Nana Adudankwa led government which by all standards is not just repugnant to our values and cultures as a people but more importantly an affront to our values as a people. The despicable conduct of the Akufuado administration in signing on to this on behalf of Ghana and for purposes of this press conference, we in the minority are not even aware of any such signed agreement brought for purposes of ratification. They further hinted at plans to table a motion in Parliament over the issue. We are looking at a motion, and the motion will inform in its words what we intend to do as a minority. We've been in government, so this culture of people thinking that it is we. We've been there. We've been there. Someday when you carry your slippers on your head, you appreciate that you are not there forever. Who still stands strong and firm in our collective resolve. I'm sure I can hasten add, it almost sounds unanimous that comprehensive sexuality education is rejected. And therefore, this administration must bow their heads in shame withdraw it, apologize to the Ghanaian people that you've done you wrong, we intended to do you wrong, but it was our intention to promote lesbianism and gay rights in this country, whilst they pretend to be builders of cathedrals, which even results in the pulling down of passport offices, homes for judges and others. Someday, we'll ask them, because now that we know this, will be interested that the home of God should be constructed with good and decent money. Good and yeah. decent money. Yeah. And therefore, whatever financing of a cathedral, not lesbian gay money, not external promoters money, but good and decent money. The minority also called on the president to fully state his position on the matter clearly. Reporting from Parliament, my name is Duke Mensopoku for City News.